Is Explorers a bad level? Upon the release of the second official 2.2 sneak peek, many Geometry Dash players were disappointed and unhappy with Robtop and this new level. Explorers is a level that has been teased by Robtop for over four and a half years, so Geometry Dash players had very high expectations for this level. But it appears the expectations were too high, because many people in the GD community expressed concern over the gameplay and the amount of gimmicks in the level. A popular argument was that Explorer seems to just show off a ton of 2.2 features without putting much thought into how fun it is to play. Gimmicks, gimmicks, gimmicks. The definition of a gimmick is a trick or device intended to attract attention, publicity, or business. The use of gimmicks is nothing new in Robtop's levels. Dryout, the fourth level ever created in Geometry Dash, exists just to show off the upside down gravity portal. Oh, oh my god, why is the upside down? Oh, what a stupid gimmick! Time Machine exists just to show off that you can now make the screen go backwards, and show how many triple spikes you can fit into one level. Oh my god, why is it doing that? So gimmicky! Sure, those are pretty minor gimmicks, so let's look at a more extreme example. The transition from 1.9 to 2.0 is huge and very rocky. Imagine having fun playing some simple 1.9 levels, then suddenly this gets added to the game as a new level. So gimmicky, right? I'm sure Deadlocked was very controversial upon release for how hard it was to sight read, but now we all love Deadlocked because we took the time to learn how to play it. Explorers is going to be the same way. Camera controls and all the new teleporting mechanics are a big change from what we're used to, but we have to be welcome to change. If we resist the change all the time, then we wouldn't even have move triggers. Explorers is a demon that will require us to actually practice. Robtop's biggest challenge with Explorers will be to make something hard enough so experienced players can't just immediately beat it and move on, but easy enough for new players to figure it out and enjoy it. Plus, what we were shown isn't even the final version. Robtop has said that the level is subject to change in both the gameplay and decoration, so we can expect to see some minor but impactful changes by the time it comes out. Now, I admit, the Slaughterhouse Wave part does seem really difficult to sight read, and I can see Robtop definitely nerving this in the final version. But other than that, it seems like a pretty swag demon so far, and we haven't even seen the drop yet. An important rule in life is expectations minus reality equals happiness. People expected groundbreaking mechanics to be revealed in this level, but as Scratch the Robot said, the real juicy stuff will have to wait for 2.2's release. This is merely a sneak peek of Explorers, not a full reveal of the update. I'm willing to bet that everyone will go crazy over Explorers when the full level comes out. Just you guys wait. If you enjoyed this video, please consider liking and subscribing. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great day.